So the most incredible thing happened to me the other day, and I just have to tell you guys about it. I um, Well, I received a client gift, and actually a few months back, I did a blog post about um, creating the perfect client gift. Um, actually, in fact, I may have done a video as well, and uh, if I find it, I'll just put it up in the corner here. Um, so anyways, I got a client gift the other day, and it's really left an impression, so much of an impression that here I am talking about it on uh, this week's blog post. So this envelope arrives, right? It's a large envelope from a hotel, could be anything. Now I've done business with this hotel. In fact, um, we just signed a contract, actually two contracts with this particular hotel. Um, so it could be copies of signed contracts. Yes, hotels still do that. Uh, could be a brochure, who knows, no idea. So open up the envelope, did a terrible job of opening it up. Sorry about that, uh, Lori. Uh, anyway, inside is um, two more envelopes. So this little brown envelope that says, Leanne, open me first. Okay, so already I'm intrigued and I'm like, do I really open this one first? Or do I jump to the second one that says, can you read that? I'll tell you what it says. It says open second. All right, so I open up the first one. Every, every ounce of my body says you should open the second one first. Kind of like Christmas, right? Let's cheat and see what's in the second one. But no, I open the first card first. And here's what's inside. So it's a thank you card from my friend Lori Yahonisky. She's the uh, sales manager at the Delta Besboro in Saskatoon where this envelope of goodies came from and the hotel where I just recently signed two contracts or rather I had two clients sign contracts with this property. So here's the note from Lori. Leanne, I wanted to send something to say thank you for all the business you have done for me and the hotel. I truly appreciate working with you and your clients. I have to tell my clients that too. My friend and old boss, Doug, works at Cedar Creek Winery and said for you to call him directly on his personal phone as he will do the tour for you, Lori. And she's got Doug's phone number on here. And then her card. So then I open this second envelope because <laughs> I already think I know what's coming. And when you know it, it is a gift certificate for a complimentary tour and tasting at Cedar Creek Winery in Kelowna with a gift card for a bottle of wine at Cedar Creek. Um, so to back up, I don't live in Saskatoon. I live in Kelowna, BC. Uh, it's a horrible place. It's a godforsaken place where you're surrounded by lakes and wineries and orchards and it's it's terrible. But I took one for the team and moved my uh, family out here a couple years ago. Um, I love wine. I'm sure Lori knows this. We probably had a few too many glasses of wine when we were doing the site tours of her hotel. So she sends me this gift, which is incredibly creative for one. She created suspense by pairing these two envelopes together. Um, she made it so incredibly personal. She knows how much I love wine. She knows I'm going to go ape shit over this. So it's so personal. And then I think the final touch, which really kind of sent it over the edge for me, was the exclusivity of it, right? I've got this winery GM's phone number. And I just, it, it just makes, made me feel so special. And Anyways, there's a thousand of things that Lori could have done um, to, to say thank you for the business. Um, and I'll be honest, there's probably a ton of ideas that would have been just as impactful. It could have been something from her hotel, even something from the destination of Saskatoon. There could have been a, a, a plethora of things that would have made me feel equally as warm inside. But I just had to share with you how incredibly thoughtful and creative and individual this particular client gift was and to say you know what this is actually possible we can as friends of our meeting planner clients we can appreciate the business they they give to us by providing them with simple experience like this that is just so personal and lets them know how much we appreciate their partnership in this meetings industry so anyways that's my 
story for today. Um, Lori, you probably didn't expect this to turn into a blog post and a, and a video, but I can't thank you enough. Um, it was just, it, it really is um, one of the sweetest things that anyone's ever given to me in this business and I can't thank you enough. So for those of you who are looking for ideas for client gifts, I'm gonna leave my uh, blog post from a few months below in this post. And then of course I've added a new uh, blog post today with some new content and ideas based on my experience this past week. So you can also find a couple client gift tips and tricks on my free download, How to Attract a Meeting Planner's Business. And you can find that over on my website at leannecalderwood.com. So I hope you enjoy. Check those posts out and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.